I'm Josh Wolf. I'm here live with Samantha and Fernando and Donald Schultz. Give it up, everybody. Um, so we have Taryn here. Let's go right to the poll. Who won and who lost? I didn't see the final oh, numbers, but... Oh, 50% Taryn, 44% me. If we combined you and Bob, this would be a tie. Yes. And what, we'd have to do it together. Are you showing off with your math skills? Yes, yeah. I am. Um, <laughs> Listen, I will do it with you if you want me to. I, was, I think that would be awesome. We'll be okay. like blood brothers. So, so I know you guys encountered a lot of leeches. Tell me about these. These are used for medicinal purposes also? The scientific name on these is actually medicinalis, which means like medicinal. And for thousands of years, they were used in bloodletting. Um, they inject an anticoagulant and antiseptic into your, your system. And they've actually done ear transplants using these animals to restart the circulation in ears because they're such fine blood vessels. So there is a medicinal use to it. What we're doing is absolutely not medicinal right. in any way. <laughs> but, but isn't there a, there's a myth that you need to debunk, right? You, if you've got a snake bite, you don't put one of these on your snake no, bite. No, where that came from is if you have a snake bite, after the snake bite is finished being healed, it will actually increase circulation in that digit or in your arm. Or if you have compartment syndrome, it will kickstart the circulation again. So if you got bitten by the snake, the worst thing you could do is attach a leech, because it's going to make a hole and then inject anticoagulants. And if it's a rattlesnake, you're going to be bleeding profusely from that wound. And you guys, got these are the same looking leeches you got bit by? No, or? we had land-based leeches, nothing in the water. They're all so, in the jungle dry. And are they, are, are they bigger, smaller, are they thicker? They're what fatter, are they? thicker. They're yeah. fatter? A little bit shorter and thicker. Now, and Donald was telling me the, the, the way to get them off you isn't to flick them, is to just to let them... Yeah, one of the things is if they're on you and you pull them off, you'll traumatize that area mm -hmm. too. And these guys will actually go on land. That's what's so tricky about them. They can live in water and then they'll climb trees and hang out on the mm -hmm. edge of branches. And as you walk past, they'll grab onto you with their basically their mouth. Well, and then, speaking of. Speaking there of. There you go. Get I'm your wearing own. a glove because we obviously don't yep. want to share leeches. That's well, just. What are the odds of people passing out from a leech? We're going to find out, aren't we? <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is. Okay. So if you look at it, it's basically doing its little leechy thing. It's what does sucking that feel on. like? So that's and that's the boom. sucking part. Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. You might so, as well put one on me okay. too. Okay. All right. Oh, oh it that, fell off. Okay. I mean, I mean that it all depends on Here, how hungry. Put my hand there in we there. go. Is he doing his thing? Yeah, he's doing his thing. I so now, so. what yep. they'll do oh, is no, they, he's not. they're going to sit on you he until even eat me. until it's that. You know what it feels like? You know what? It doesn't feel great. Let's just go right they for don't, it. They don't want this. If you put your hand down, it'll go towards it. Oh, see, like, this was, this was escaping. It's trying to find blood. I mean, you know what? These, okay. these, these they're scared just, of me. They are That's what they're yeah. frightened of me. Look at so that. If you, if you yeah. stick your hand down at the bottom and start touching them, they have two different ways of sensing human beings, and one of them is chemoreceptors, and the other one is electrical current. So this guy's actually busy hunting right now. Where? So oh. this, this guy around the surface, he's busy I mean, he's around. pretty stupid. I'm right in the middle of the water. <laughs> He's not a great hunter, is he? I mean, that's that's the thing. Is leeches? It all depends on how they're feeling and what they want to do. They. they I had no idea they were so emotional. They're, emo right? they're emotional. They're emotional eaters. I didn't know leeches were emotional eaters. <laughs> um, t tell me something. Like, how do you? These are used for medicinal purposes. Yes. To do. Basically, restart circulation. So oftentimes, in a surgical case, like if if a person's had a bad burn or transplant skin grafts, you'll go and add the leeches to the surgical site and it helps with microsurgery. And it's funny because for the longest time it was, you know, an old wives' tale and then they found out that this is actually in fact legitimate science and it does work. But I can't tell I've never wanted a leech to bite me so bad. <laughs> I know, it's true.